as on defense. He uh, uh, has improved on playing the run, which has been something that he's had to work on. And uh, he's done a great job of doing that. He's not a naturally a big guy, but he's packed on a little bit of weight. And uh, Lance has done an, an awesome job uh, getting him to play a little more physical in the run game. How does someone that small, I guess, technique, make an impact? Leverage and technique. I mean, that's really uh, everything in football. And if you have some power and you got some leverage and you play with good technique, then you can play in there if you're undersized. If you don't, then you're going to struggle. So I think that's something he's learned and continue to improve on. He's not um, you know, where he needs to be, but he's gotten a lot better. Coach, do you draw any hard conclusions from spring? You know, guys have shown you a lot in three uh, weeks. We you leave it pretty yeah, open? we still have a lot of work to do. I mean, that's one conclusion. I think we've improved. We've definitely improved up to this point, and we have uh, really have no room to take any steps backwards. Uh, I thought there's some guys that have shown up, but as a whole, uh, you know, I, uh, we, we've still got a ways to go before we're playing the way we want to play. But do you at least, I mean, can you tell a difference in just having, I mean, that? Now being a full year, as yeah, no doubt. After the bowl game, yeah, we're better. We're better. I mean, we've improved. I mean, we've shown improvement in the last three weeks, but that doesn't make your rest any easier. Uh, you know, there's always a sense of urgency that we've got to improve on certain things and in certain positions, and that's no different now. So uh, we'll go into the off season um, with some positions unsettled, and that's okay. But we've got to continue to work in the weight room and through the summer and into the fall to get better at those positions, so we can go out and compete at, at a high level. Is depth as big a concern across the board as it was last year? Can you see it kind of creeping up? Yeah, I don't, I don't, you know, hopefully this next class will add some depth. But I've never heard any coach really say, "Yeah, we feel great about our depth." You know, sometimes you have more than others, but uh, we need to definitely build build some because uh, I think it has been pretty light for the last year. So, Justin Derrick was kind of critical of the defense yesterday when we talked to him. Was it as much a step back? to you as it seemed to be for him yesterday? Yeah, well, we just didn't finish any plays. Yeah, I mean, that was frustrating because uh, I, I don't think the, the energy, I thought our effort was okay, but effort, you know, only gets you so far. We didn't finish many plays. We were in position to make some and we didn't, and we didn't finish very aggressive at the ball and that's a problem. So um, it's a challenge to come out every day with that attitude and it's not easy. It's, you know, when the game comes and, and uh, you know, usually you'll have that good energy, but if you don't prepare throughout the week with good energy and, and have a sense of urgency about you, then and especially if you come out in a scrimmage and, and aren't, you know, if you're a little bit flat, then I don't care how talented you are or aren't, you're gonna get you're gonna get your tails kicked. So.